Welcome to Bite Size Piano. In this tutorial, I'm going to teach you how to play the piano part that you just heard from Back to Black by Amy Winehouse. This will be my first Amy Winehouse tutorial. It's very repetitious, so it, the whole song is mostly what you've just heard in the preview, and then the bridge part is slightly different. I will play each section, but I'm only gonna sing the chorus and the bridge part just because of some of the nature of some of the lyrics in the verses. But I have left the full chords and lyrics down below. So this one is in the key of D minor, so on the screen now are all the notes of the scale of D minor, specifically in the scale of D harmonic minor. The C sharp in there. So those are the notes we're using. So the right hand is going to be playing, it's going to be fairly stationary throughout the whole song. I'll teach you the right hand first actually. So the left hand uh, will be blue and the right hand will be orange on the screen. So here is middle C, so if you locate that pitch on your keyboard or piano just so you know where we are in relation to that note. So the first chord is D minor. D F A. So this is in root position and you're going to play that eight times. So actually the right hand is chords are keeping the pulse and the left hand is playing a bass line around it. So we've got one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. And then the next chord is G minor second inversion. So it's D, G and B flat and you're going to play that eight times as well. And the next chord is B flat major, so all you're going to do is change the G to an F and keep the D and the B flat the same. And this is first inversion of B flat major, and you play that eight times. And then the last chord in the progression is A major first inversion, so that's C sharp, E and A uh, eight times as well. When I do that, it's because I'm just showing, trying to make it clear which notes I'm playing, but don't obviously play like that. Play with a raised wrist and relaxed fingers. So I'll do all that progression again. So D minor. G minor. B flat major. A major. Do it one more time. So the left hand is playing this bass line. You're going to be playing root notes plus a couple of passing notes. I play it with the right hand. So the left hand is going to play D first of all. I'll do it very slowly. Together, right, left, together, right, left. That's the first bit. Together, right, left, together, right, left. And then another four times. Right, right, left, right. Left to a C, then right. So we've got and then change to G. So you've got G in the left hand, so together. together, right, left, right, and then A flat, right. So I'll do that again. Together, right, left, together, right, together, right, left, right, left, right. 
a bit quicker. So, so far we have. And then the next bit, so we've got B flats, so together, right, left, together, right, together, right, left, right, change to an F in the left hand, right, B flat. So every chord has a different pattern pretty much for the left hand. So together, right, left, together, right, together, right, left, right, left, right, left. And then we have A major, so A is in the left hand, so we've got together, again. And of that of course leads back into the D minor chord. So I'll do that a bit quicker. hand is often playing in between the right hand because right hand's playing the beats on the beats and the left hand is usually playing off beats in between them so I'm going to do that whole progression again hi there just quickly before we continue if you are enjoying the video so far please consider hitting that like button and say hi in the comments section below if you're brand new here please consider subscribing you know where the button is and make sure to hit that notifications bell so you're notified every time I upload a new tutorial and you can be the first to learn. I've left a load of playlists in the description as well to get you started. I hope you enjoy the rest of the tutorial and let's continue. <laughs> is also swung so it's kind of more like Once for the intro, you play that through four times for the verse, and then once for the chorus. I'll just demonstrate the chorus. We always think about the words I died a hundred times. You go back to hide, I go back to. And then it's into the 
verse again. So you only do that chorus once. So the second verse you play through two times, and then you play the chorus two times. We only said goodbye, we words I died a hundred times. You go back to hide, I go back to We only said goodbye, we words I died a hundred times. You go back to hide. like tambourine bit for two bars and then it's into the black, black. so into these chords so I'm playing octaves in my left hand and um, you can just keep to playing singular notes so the chords are similar to what we've done a couple of new ones in there so this is the only bit that's different really so we have D minor so D or D's in the left hand, the right hand is F, A, D. And you're just gonna hold these down. Black. And then you're gonna change the A to a B flat. I'm gonna use my third finger. And then B flat's in the left hand. Black. And then we have F major. So it's F, A, C in the right hand. The left hand, that's just F's. That's A major, A, C sharp, E. So do you, you do that whole chord progression two times, and then at the end you add the G into the into the A major chord, make it an A7 chord. Let's demonstrate that bit. Black. And then it's into this again, uh, for the chorus two more times. We only said goodbye with words I died a hundred times You go back to hide and I go back to We only said goodbye with words I died a hundred times on the D minor chord at the end. So that's the end of the video. I hope you enjoyed it and that it's useful. If you'd like to leave a piano tutorial request, you need to click on this video, which takes you through to my official request space. You do need to be subscribed. All requests are noted and considered. So I look forward to seeing you over there.